Hello everybody, how is it going? Welcome to another episode of XCOM Chimera Squad. Guys, it is time that we play the next main mission here, take down the progeny. Although, I gotta say, we would lower the unrest here by three and only get a bit of money. I don't know if we should do it right now, or maybe we just take these missions to lower the unrest and so on. I think that's a, that's a good idea as well, because we would also get an acid grenade as well as negative two unrest as well as 25 intel here. I'd say that's that's a good thing to do right now. Um, also, we have a bunch of intel left over and it's Thursday. So next day, we're going to get a lot of stuff because it's Friday. Friday is payday. And as a result, I think I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to upgrade here. We get more bonus intel income. And we cannot sadly do another one of that, but that's fine. All right. So um, getting intel here is, I think, crucial for my overall map control. Anyway, um, one more thing. We have... Torque, I think, uh, sitting around doing nothing currently. I do definitely, I definitely do want to get some more money here. So we're gonna select Torque, and we're gonna begin this whole situation here. Three days until we get a bit more money, and then I want to outfit my my agents a bit more. All right, guys. So first mission. Let's go ahead and play the stacks. Let's do it. Uh, enemies have flashbang grenades, by the way. So, that's a bit of a, more of a problem, maybe. But hey, let's see what we can do. Let's see what we can do. I should have taken a look at how many missions we actually play here. But I think it's gonna be okay. Let's check this out, guys. Contraband confirmed on site. You're good to go. That's a nightclub. Wow. So, breach mode. Uh, lead by example. First unit through the entrance gains plus three damage during the breach. I want high damage, so we're gonna put Godmother in there. And share up, then terminal, and then patchwork. Breach, breach, breach. Let's go ahead and breach it. All right. So again, we have massive damage here on um, Godmother, and I think I'm gonna directly go for the Archon. Hell yeah, let's go. Down they go. Perfect. 70%, 65, 64, 61, that's a 70. I could also use Phalanx, but I could also not do that. No, you know what, it's fine. Feels to me like we got more to do later. All right, unconscious, as well as... This could also be an unconscious, right? Maybe not. Maybe not. Alrighty, so, trooper, sorcerer, bruiser. That's all we got so far. Yeah, this seems very much like a multi-mission here. Alright, the trooper is next. So I guess we're gonna try to take him out. 40... Eh, this is not good. Let's go and subdue him, you know? That's, that's, that's I think, a thing that we can do. Also, wait. Subduing... Always ends the turn. Shooting also ends the turn. Alright, let's go here. Getting more people unconscious means more Master intel for us. Subdued. So... Uh, next one. Huh. What about the hit chance here? It's actually quite okay. So I want to go kinetic shield on, let's say... You know what? Patchwork. Patchwork is fine here. Shields up. Let's do that. Alrighty. And I think I'm just gonna shoot them. I could also go with the charge bash. Yeah, you know what? That's, that's a better idea. That's movement and damage. At the same time. And we have the guard skill afterwards. Here comes the bruiser though. He's flanking. He's not doing anything though. Oh, that's fun. Alright. Um, I think I'm gonna go... Ooh, this is interesting. This is very interesting. I'm gonna go cooperation. With Cherub? Or I could take... I could take Godmother. I think she has a good line of sight here. Alright, let's check this out. Does that work? Yeah, we get an immediate shot. Ah, that's the bruiser. I want to get her, a sorcerer there. And we got him! The armor piercing rounds coming through. Not bad. And as a result, we can then shoot here. Easy. Not a single point of damage taken so far. Uh, do you have trank rounds? I don't know. Can I tell somehow? I, I don't know. Maybe we just go ahead and just shock him with 100% chance. Let's do that. Well done. Oh, it's encounter one out of two. It says it up here. Cool. Zap. Two people unconscious. So we need three more on, uh, to in order to get the maximum uh, chance for intel here, which is 100%. 
That is bonus intel. Alright, we're gonna breed. There's a vent. That's cool. Oh, no, wait. Is that a vent or is that, you know, it's a, it's a breaching charge thing. Anyway, uh, quick disable. First unit through the entrance will have their weapons disabled. That's a problem. Ready for anything? All units through the entrance getting dodge 50. Okay. Also, explosive entrance. All non-aggressive enemies guarding the entrance are surprised. Last unit through the entrance will have their weapon disabled. I can deal with that. Do I want them surprised? I think I want them surprised. Alright. So, Patchwork has a drone. And she can always, always use that. Uh, by the way, combat scanners are actually quite good here. Let's How's go ahead and breach. An the enemies are surprised and they are combat scanned. <laughs> Boom. Here we go. And we're gonna use Patchwork's drone for most of the damage that we are going to deal here. Ooh. Resonance. A Brute. Wow, there's a bruiser. That's a lot, I gotta say. We're gonna definitely go Phalanx here. Alright. And I definitely also want to get this, uh, this Archon down. Godmother. Nice, AP rounds doing damage. And it's unconscious. Perfect. Wait, we have a 100% chance to get the Resonant down. I mean, 100% hit chance, and we have a chance, 4 out of uh, 4 to 6 damage, to get the maximum 6, and then the resonant is off the board. Which is very interesting to me. Yeah, I think I want to check check that out. Let's see, guys. Let's do it. 5. Okay. Yeah, he is, he is in subdue range, and that is good. It's really good. Uh, there's a sorcerer, a hitman. There's so much. Target in sight. Evac as soon as you have it. Ah, we also have to evac, so let's keep that in mind. Also, what's going on with Cherub here? A uh, little bit of floaty. Uh, alright, anyway. Anyway, I think Cherub is actually gonna go charge bash this. No, wait, 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 wait. Kinetic shield first. Kinetic shield on actually patchwork. There's patchwork, there's patchwork. Let's go. I have a plan for that. And then he's gonna subdue or charge bash. This dude here. Yep, seems good to me. I mean, he's always guarded, so that's the good news. Alright. So, one more guy unconscious, and we got maximum intel. Eh, that's a grace. Comes a hitman. It's probably... All of them are probably gonna go for... Cherub now? No, they are not. Wow. And they are going on Overwatch. That's interesting. So, let's talk hit chance. I honestly want to get that bruiser down. We have a pretty good chance to do it. I ventilate here. Using all of my ammo, also destroying his cover. But I don't need to. Why would I? Let's fire. Sorcerer is next, though. That's a, that's a brute there. It's also a chance to get this guy that is flanking us currently off the board. Again, this bruiser is pretty low in initiative. Maybe we are just going for the hitman here. That's okay. It's Great. a start. I'm out. So. Um, ooh, I could team up. I could definitely do that. So this is the last round anyway. But who do we take? It could be Godmother again. Alright, alright, alright. I want to team up with Godmother. Team up. There we go. So she has another active turn after this. And um, then... We're gonna move. Mm, I wanna shoot and then move, but I can't. So this is how we do it. Go here. And then reload. Why did I not have ammo? Oh, because our weapons got disabled by the grenade. Oh, that's why. Ah, oh, damn it. I screwed it up a little bit. Uh, anyway. So here's the thing. I want to go here, subdue him, having good cover. Arrested the target. Nice. There's a sorcerer though. So what is she gonna do? Probably doing something with the brute here. Maybe establishing a link. Tyranny. Oh wow, devastating blow coming in. We're no stunned ammo. for two rounds. Really that is horrible. That is really bad. So we have to stasis field. Uh, let's go ahead and. We could actually put Cherub into a stasis field here. 
But you know what? I'm gonna put the sorcerer into the stasis. And we're gonna deal with the stuff that is around here. Alright. And... So, our weapons are disabled, which is a bit of a problem right now. Alright, I'll go chain lightning here. I don't think it will jump over to the brute. No, they are too too far away. But they are disoriented. That's okay. I was hoping for a stun, honestly, but yeah. Didn't quite get it. Cherub in the meantime is fine. Alright. Um... The Brute will have an active turn quite quickly. Means I should probably shoot him from here. Let's fire. Alright, very good. Four damage. That's perfect. That is enough to technically try to subdue him. Oh! Since his aggressive move after we he got damaged, he got zapped by the drone and now he is definitely in subdue range. Now that's cool. So, give me my active turn. Terminal? Ah, oh, there we go. So, subduing him. It's always an option. Yeah, we'll do it like this. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Subdue him. Alrighty. Now, the sorcerer will come out of stasis, not doing anything. We have to deal with the sorcerer soon. But that's fine. And um, and then what? Also making a subdue happen, or... Oh no, I have an idea. We just move next to him. We don't need ammo when we have a zapping drone. And now we can use the drone to already deal damage to the sorcerer. Alright. Immune to mental effects. So she cannot be disoriented or stunned, so it seems. Cool, Cherub is back in action. That's perfect. I actually... Can we can we go? Can we do that? Where would our Eva Exile be? I don't know. But this looks good. I could Let have used my... Ah, that's a thing that I forgot. I could have used my, 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 my... It is a uh, kinetic, kinetic feel thing. Alright. Ah, shooting her is actually not good here. Alright. Ah, we can cooperate, though. Let's cooperate with... You know what? Cherub is okay. And he's gonna go... Charge Bash from this direction. Alright, unconscious. And now we can push the button. Encrypt the blueprints. Pretty good. Now we need to get our hell out of here, right? Oh yeah, this is the evac. Easy. Alright. So, enemy reinforcements. They will come in. Quite quite soon, but I think we have a pretty good positioning. Uh, yeah, evac, please. No ammo. I need to reload. Not quite, though. Alright, alright, alright. So, we're gonna dash over here. She, at the very least, has kinetic field, so that's the good news. Wow, that's a lot of them. Holy hell. But fine. More bruises. Alright, 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 alright. This is actually quite scary. Um, I'm gonna give um, Terminal another shield. Armored up. And then we're gonna get the hell out of here, I think. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's just run. We might take a bit of damage as a result here. Because the kinetic shield will break now. And if we are unlucky... These two bruises on the high ground will also shoot patchwork. And we are not quite there. Might as well move here. Pin down this bruiser. Okay. Give me a moment to reload. And then we move here. Can we still evac after we shot the drone? I don't think so. I'm gonna evac here. Not sure if that's a thing. I wanna just play it safe. So. Ooh, Patchwork still... Uh, sorry, Terminal still has a bit of a problem here. Yeah, two more people before her. 
And she is flanked. Luckily, we got missed here. And here's the last bruiser. Going riot guard. Uh-huh. And then shooting for three. No, that's fine. Okay, so now we're gonna get out of here. Into the action. And uh, here we go. Let's do the evac. Pretty good. So we have two lightly wounded. Excellent rating. We definitely get the bonus inter here with seven captured enemies. That's perfect. All right. So here we go. We will reduce the unrest in this district by two. So that's cool. Uh, unrest in the stacks has lowered to one. Unrest in Renova Heights has risen to four. But that's okay. So let's check this out. Uh, we can use do not trust aliens. Vigilance. No? And that's great. But you are trying to do so. And it is enough for me. We're gonna use vigilance here and everything is Good. awesome again. Look at that. That's perfect. So we have Dragnet, which we cannot really use here, I believe. What's that? Minus one, minus three? Minus one unrest in Old Town District. Oh, minus three city anarchy. Oh, I see, I see, I see, I see. And we have some level ups here as well. So we're gonna take a look at the promotions first. All right, Shiro, what do you get? Either recharge, using charge bash to render an enemy unconscious refills a charge. Oh, you can chain off of that, that's pretty cool. Or resonance field, allies with kinetic shield gain 15 aim. Both of them are actually quite cool. Do we want him as a support or do we want him as a as a charger? That's that's a tough question, I gotta say. 50 name is actually quite good. I think best judge ran an enemy unconscious refills a charge. I think I like the aim. Alright. So on terminal. Uh, armor system. Upgrade safeguard to provide one armor to the protected unit. Ooh, I am not using that thing so often though. It might become in handy later when the when the missions are getting a little bit more difficult. But let's see, resilience terminal heals up to full at the end of every encounter. So we can actually use her as a tank. And she will be uh, healed up in the next encounter directly. I like that idea. It's another it's another um, agent that we don't have to worry about that much anymore. The full heal is super super helpful. At the same time, we have her drone heal the entire team as a breach, um, as a breach event, by two. Plus one armor. I like the full here. All right, I don't have to worry about her anymore. Or let's say I can put her at, at uh, a more risky position now. Cool. So critical mission. The mission must be completed today. Uh, by the way, we got a lot of intel and, and money and delirium thanks to the fact that it's Friday. We get more credits when we when we finish a mission here, if we upgrade this now. Let's do it. That should give us 55 more credits. Hell yeah! That was a good investment. Absolutely. Uh, what can we do here? Mm, five more Illyrian income, more bonus rewards on this district missions. I think we're gonna keep the intel. Because there's nothing we can do anyway. Alright, let's play the critical missions. Dragnet doesn't do anything. No valid targets, no. Alright, guys. It's a very difficult mission. I hope that we can do it. They have flashbangs. Uh, two encounters, by the way. Alright. Let's launch. I know that uh, a bunch of people have dif different agents uh, as their as their priority agents and as the ones that the I like the most, but my team but is actually quite good right now. Up. Whatever they're building isn't finished. We need to make sure it stays that way. Alrighty, guys, let's breach them. Ooh, that's three different breach points. Reflex boost. All units entering gain 25 defense first round. Uh huh. Overseer. Last unit through the entrance automatically activates Overwatch. Oh, that's strong. Uh, ready for anything? All units in the entrance gain 50 dodge. Alright, we're gonna put... That's a difficult question, actually. I'll put terminal here. Um, defense is important for patchwork as well. 
Let me go to Cherub. And I want Godmother and Overwatch because she deals so much damage. Alright, guys, here we go. Let's breach! Ready to go. Open sesame. And here we are, guys. So, Thrall, be gone. Good. Uh, that's a 100% chance to get the Brute. Or well, to hit the Brute, not to get him. Ooh, Codex. Oh my god, oh my god. I hate these things. Wow, there's a lot of people here. Holy hell, there's also a Resonant. Yeah, I think, you know what, I'm gonna go for the Codex. Let's see what it does. We dealt three damage. Do we Alpha Strike? Vice Shotgun during the Breach will take the turn early on the timeline. Godmother also gains one bonus action in the first turn. I don't think we need to. We're gonna take this guy out. Bye. And then we're gonna fire, oh my god, at the Arkin in the back? Or just as the, yeah, at the Resonant in front of us. Oh wow, oh wow, oh wow, lots of misses here. Holy cow. <laughs> so having the defense actually helped out. Yeah, there's an Arkan. There's shielding. What is, what is that? What is this little thing? Locking down hostiles. Never seen that before. It's like they are drawing some energy off of this. Um, all right. So, patchwork, you definitely put a brood into stasis because that thing is scary. Or the Arkin, and we kill the Brute. The Brute is very late. Alright, that's the stasis here. Here we go. Yeah, we will probably be able to destroy the Brute completely. Resonance Pylon, I am not entirely sure. I would rather gain, or get this guy down now. Zap. Hey, he's disoriented as well. That's cool. And we need four more damage to get him down completely. Hey, Brute. I know you're aggressive. Come over me. Come over here. Oh, look at that. There was somebody with Overwatch. <laughs> nice combo. <laughs> Didn't even plan for that, but that was cool. Ouchie. That's two damage from a lightning physical... No, psychological bolt. Psychic bolt. Whatever that is called. <laughs> Uh, let's see your chance. This Resonator seems difficult. I don't know. It's a good target now. Yeah, I will... Uh, yeah, I will shoot it. Uh, but we only shoot it after we have put a Kinetic Shield on someone. Actually, Patchwork is not in a good spot there. But Godmother wants to be aggressive this round. Let's put it in Godmother so she can actually move forward. And then we're gonna shoot this Resonator Pylon. Pilot? Pylon. Cool. That's good. Uh, resonance. What's it doing there? There was something going on, definitely. Anyway, um, I will subdue this guy with terminal soon. What do we do about the other guys? This could be a kill. I want to I want to get closer and I want to try to get the kill here. So Yeah. Let's jump in here. We have the shield at the very least. I know, I know, I know. We are exposed, but we have a 100% chance. Sadly, we are one off. Uh-oh. Here comes the brute. Oh wow. That was actually in range. Man, I'm so happy that we got the shield here. And we got a charge. I mean, that's not bad. Yeah, these resonance. Ouchie. Huh. Alright, Acolyte. How do we kill the Acolyte before it does anything? We only have a 40% chance to hit here. I could go cooperation and then shoot, but my position here is garbage. Oh wait, I could go cooperation and then punch. Let's cooperate with... Where is she? Godmother. Okay. 
So Godmother being able to, not ventilate, to subdue. Yeah, that's a good position. Let's go. Subdue him. Arrested the and we're gonna subdue the other guy as well. Stay down. Cool. And all of a sudden we have a pretty good position and they are flanked. Ah! Alright. Acolyte didn't do anything? No, Acolyte is not even there. Ooh, that is a potential kill before he does anything. Oh yeah, I like to take that. Uh, so we're gonna move here. Heading Hello. Back. Zap him. Nice. And now we have another turn. That is 4 to 6 with 97. Do we have Trank Rounds? Yes or no? I don't know. It's 97, it's not 100. I wanna make sure. Let's check if we have Trank Round. Let's see. I believe in the numbers. And yeah, he is not unconscious, obviously. Why is he able to move? He was coming out of stasis. Ah! Help! Ah, that's a critical! We need to heal! We definitely need to heal. So, uh, most important thing. Uh, yeah, shield her. We're gonna save Patchwork here. Also, 50 name. Not bad. And then we're gonna shoot the Brute. Why am I shooting the Brute? Because... Actually, do we shoot or do we charge bash him? I wonder if the if the charges are, charges are carrying over to the next encounter. I don't think so. Might as well fire our weapon. Might as well just charge bash him. Cool. Four damage. Oh, I didn't actually want to end up here. Again. Well, it's okay. I'm running low. So you're running low. I know. I know. I know. What about hit chance here? We could try to subdue him. That would be that would be a gamble though, because we deal two to three damage. We need the three. Okay. So is it a move and shoot situation? I think it is. Here we go. Getting cover against the Arkin. And hitting the brute with a hundred percent. This is our last shot for the moment. Alright, down goes the brute. And now we have terminal. And terminal could either. Shoot this guy or heal. I think she wants to heal, honestly. I'm hoping that the Archon is not doing anything bad. <laughs> let's see. Uh yeah, let's go. Safeguard her. Let's get your insides back inside. That's perfect. Yay, we got four HP healed. Uh, and we have stasis again. He's also disoriented. Hmm. I wonder if we can actually get a stun. Let's check this out. I want to see if I can get the stun. So here we go. Uh, that didn't zap him. Thought it would. Never mind. But that's a 100% chance. Come on, get the stun out, little one. Stun for two rounds. Perfect. Yeah, he's not gonna do anything anymore. That means we can actually run in, charge bash him. I should have checked out if the kinetic shield would carry over, but I don't think it would again. So I'd say we come in with full HP. No, Cherub got a bit of damage. Uh, all right, all right, all right, all right. Elevators have been out for decades, so you get to take an alternate form of transport to the top. An enormous trampoline? <laughs> it's an anti-gravity sled, cobbled together by squatters during the occupation. Mildly exposed to the elements. Well, mild to moderate exposure. You'll All right. Fine. Breach mode! So, what do we get? Uh, that's obviously bad. So we're gonna take Reflex Boost, all units gain 25 defense, nice, good visibility, all units gain 25 aim during the breach. I mean, that's a no-brainer, is it? Alright, we'll take that. 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 Uh, definitely combat scan. Absolutely. And we... We cannot go flash bomb, sadly. Let's go refresh. Get some... 
Yeah, you know what? We're gonna get some some health on on Cherub as well. Stay behind me. It's a lot of enemies though, so we are facing five at the same time here. But with a bit of luck, we can take out like two of them in this breach. All right, Codex has to go. Echolite, I see. Arkin, wow. Ah, man, there's a resonant as well. We have defense, right? These guys are not really hitting us. Let's go. I want to be aggressive. That's a nice crit we got. Uh, this is Godmother. Godmother is gonna use her 4 to 6 on something that actually dies in one shot. Yep. Alright, that's the follow-up here. Nice, another critical. And now we have 100% on the Arkin. Let's do it. Okay, seems good. Seems very good. <laughs> Holy hell, that's a lot of enemies still. What, what is that? Wait a second. Wait, 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 wait. These holo things here. Like, they have additional blue, th blue stuff. Okay, let's check this out. Is there, like, additional hit points? Is there temporary hit points that, uh, that they are getting from these beacons? It might be. Mm -hmm. I want to take it out. I want to see what it does. And for that... Oh wait, if I team up now... Then I won't get a double turn, right? Not really. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, we will definitely... Okay, so before we do anything, we check hit chance. This is 100% on the pylon. I want to take that out. I will give also, I will give, uh, let's say, you the shield. Alright, patchwork, let's go. And then we're gonna stay here and hit the pylon. I mean, it's an immovable object. Should be easy to hit. Yeah, it actually lost the charge here. Uh-oh. Burn out? What's that? Looks like we have some effects on us. We better get this guy off the field now. Hey, dude. Oh yeah, look at that. That's uh, extra HP, so it seems. Um. Yeah. Get him down before he does something. Ouch. Big brute coming in. But anyway. Um. Hmm. Hmm. I mean, I could put the Brute into stasis. I could put the Acolyte into stasis as well. The Brute is our next big target anyway. Uh, Resonant. No, let's put the put the Acolyte. Where's the Acolyte? I cannot see him? Oh, I, th I thought I could see him. Well then, it's this guy. Fine. No problem. Alright, he's not gonna do anything this round. That's perfect. <sighs> Okay, and then... Uh, can we take Godmother to take out the Acolyte before we do that? Maybe. Okay. No, 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 I didn't want to use Jerob. Uh, Okay, my bad. My bad, I misclicked that. Okay. Let's just zap him so that the, the spell that he's preparing is not coming out. Maybe it does. Alright, okay, so the effect uh, has been removed. Alright, alright, so we have a full turn here. It's worth noting. What do we do with it? I believe that I want to go Kinetic Shield on, let's say, uh, maybe you. Protected yeah, you are pretty angles. much in the open there. And then I can either shoot this guy. Oh, we can go ahead and punch him. I mean, seriously, why not? Let's do it. Very nice, three damage. And of course, we have somebody here that is guarding. That's perfect. So, brute. Oh, okay, yeah, of course, he is aggressive, so he, he moves after he, he takes damage. Obviously. Tyranny, perfect. That's a wasted turn. 
Oh no, wait! That's a ah uh, no, that's an extra turn. I was thinking that you know it was just a buff. No, they take an extra turn. That's actually a cool combination. Cooperation. What are we doing now? No, oh, I know what I want to do. I want to cooperate with Patchwork. Here we go. Patchwork, sending the drone in on the brute. Jolting the target. So we don't have to worry about him anymore. And then we have the Resonant here. That is coming out of stasis, not doing anything, right? Uh, we also have to start the generator at some point. Oh well. Oh well. Uh, Pylon? Sure, we drop him. Very nice. Five damage, that's actually quite sizable. That should have destroyed his shields now, right? So yeah, so everybody who is who is uh, able to, you know, use um, psionic powers seems to get additional HP, like shielding HP, from each resonator on the field. This is what I interpret from it. Uh, let's just move. And I think we can be very aggressive here. Alright. Here it comes. Godmother! 79 is good. Nice. AP round stealing 5 damage. This is actually pretty good. Having the high weapon, the high damage weapon, also breach their armor is super good. Uh, coming out of stasis. That's good. Uh, easy. We move here. I. And we can either shoot you or use the... You know what? I'm gonna jolt you. You got him. Maybe I should. Maybe I should have gone for the resonant there with the with the jolt, hoping for. Uh, what's it called? Hoping for, hoping for. There's a word for it. Um. Man, man, man! Hoping for the the stun. Didn't get it though. I mean, everybody is shielded. Oh, there is no real. No real danger right now. And I'm gonna position. put Cherub over here already so that he Good can start the generator. It seems like we have to actually start it and then... There are more reinforcements coming and so on and so on. Okay, let's see if we can get an angle. There you go. We can get an angle. Alright. Five damage! Beautiful. His turn. That means we should probably try to get a... Nice. Um, to get a subdue on him. Getting extra intel is super crucial. Bam. No and I think Godmother is actually able to get it done. Hell yeah! Here comes Godmother. So, where would our evac be? Probably here, right? Getting getting out of this uh, on the stairs? I don't know. Uh, it's Cherub's turn. You know what? I'm just gonna... Can I reload? I don't even need to reload. Let's go on Overwatch here. Call it if you see fine. Movement. All right. And now we're gonna go dash here. Okay, I'm moving. Start the generator and see what happens. Maybe something big is coming. I don't know. Oh, this is our evac. That's good. Yeah, there will be reinforcements. Uh, here's the thing. I think I want to play it slow. Like, really slow. This will be a dash. Can I just move? No, I can't. Ah, that's a bit tragic. But if I move here... And then go... On Overwatch in this direction, we should get it done. I'm running low. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Still, it's the same thing. We don't get cover here, but if we have enough Overwatch, these guys won't be able to hit us. Also, we have Kinetic Shield. Okay, we go Overwatch. Covering my zone. Gotta be here. And we also go on over. You guessed it right. Watch! Okay, three people there. Uh, actually, two people there. I'm kind of hoping that some of these are coming towards us. Ah, damn it.
Yeah, this will just be a dash and the kinetic shield. Or like a, like a move and a shield for him. Our Overwatch did nothing. Nobody came in through this. Wonder if the game was um, was calculating that. They were like, oh, no, we have like three people watching this area. We're going to come out or come in in the, in the other area now. No idea, man. No idea. And I think we can just go now. Cherub is fine. He's not going to get contested. Oh, that's interesting. That's a miss. I was thinking that I had to no ammo. actually move here. And then... But it's the gravity sled. Oh, I have to get on the gravity sled at the same time with everybody. I see. So we cannot just get out of here. Ow. Don't you dare hitting me. I'm gonna put you in a stasis now. Actually, holy shit. Yeah, that's the thing that I will do. Okay. Target grounded. Good. So he's not gonna do anything that quickly. And we can... Oh, crap. We cannot get... No, wait. No, we can get behind this here. This is actually giving us cover. That's what I was hoping for. So we have to wait another round. More reinforcements coming. Nice disorient. To this is actually pretty good. I didn't even think about it. Using patchwork as, a, as an area denial. That's good. It's really good. Better get going here, right? Yeah. I wonder if Terminal has the this uh, teamwork ability. Cooperation, that is. All right, she has it. Let's go cooperate on Patchwork, and Patchwork is gonna take her turn then. She's like, come on, Patchwork! We gotta get the hell out of here! And she's like, yeah, yeah, okay, I'm coming! Wait for me, guys! And then we overwatch this area. So what am I supposed to do now? Are we going? Yeah, this is it. This is the end of this uh, breach here. Cool. Yeah, we lost the shields. We lost everything. That's, that's good to know. We did it. That's a cool mission. Hmm. Training can be used to heal scars, increase ancient stats, and even gain new abilities. I want to get there at some oh, that point. That sled is noisier than expected. The progeny must know you're here. You heard him. Try not to get shot off the building. Oh, there's another breach. Ooh, okay, okay. Pinpoint, success shots. Ooh, successful shots on enemies will grit. I know who I'm gonna put there. Uh, units can use the run and gun ability on their first turn. Let's take terminal here. First unit three entrance is marked until the end of the encounter. That's definitely Cherub. Ooh, patch rack is a bit low. I'm not happy with that. We cannot use our grenades, can we? Give me a second. Can I use grenade here? No, not available. Alright. Should I put patchwork here? Ah, it's fine. Reaching in. I think we're gonna get this done here. It's go time. Oh, I see an Arkin. Alright, so who do we shoot? I can use Phalanx. I haven't used Phalanx yet. Let's go, Phalanx. Come on, we attract fire here. And now we're gonna try to take out, I don't know, maybe just the Arkin. There's a Codex up there. Taking them out first turn is, I think, a good idea in general. The Thrall would be an instant kill. Uh, let's take him. Okay. So, this is uh, Alpha Strike. I definitely want to use Alpha Strike here. Oh, we only have two targets? No, that's... Oh, that's bad. That's really bad. Ooh. Uh... Sorcerer is also a thing that we see. Alright. That was bad. 66. What's the big guy? I will take that. Alright, we got a bit of damage in there. Oh, that was so good. 
That was so good taking Phalanx here because you see that? We got three hits that we just shrugged off. Holy crap, that's a lot of enemies. What is going on here? And all of them are getting shields from these stupid pylons. You shouldn't be here. I have not lit the torch. Full up. Okay. Okay. I guess we have to use some AoE here. I mean, luckily we have a grenade and we have uh, the charge bash. Okay, where can we bring that to good use? No. Ooh. Huh. Not, not really. We are not quite in range. I want to. Ideally, I want to hit two people at the same time. That's not really possible. No. It doesn't do anything. That's the problem. I mean, we would deal six damage. Th that is a damage that we should consider here. Yeah, this is also just short. They have a pretty good setup. Now, where do we want to apply six damage? The Codex? What's going on here? They are fully charged because of these pylons. This is just bad. This is just really bad. Okay, so let's go. Kinetic shield on... Oh, man. I guess on yourself, buddy. Because you're gonna have a nice journey in front of you. All right, here we go. Let's let's do it. You're gonna hit the throb. All right, one guy down. Sorcerer teleport. Fine. Oh man, the Arcan only has one hit point left, but now that he is shielded, ugh. Oh wait, and he's going into tyranny. Uh oh. Ah oh, yeah, coming close is actually good. So we are able to hit him a bit better. And he's passing his tyranny on. Oh, what was that? Alright, we get a charge. Okay, 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 okay. Um Yeah, patchwork. I mean. I mean, that's 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 patchwork. What's she gonna do? Stasis is not ready. Oh, I was hoping for it. Um Sure, we move forward. Watch my back. Let's do it. Chain lightning. Bam. Disoriented. Cool. And then we're gonna like either shoot somebody. Or hit one of these pylons. Is that the way to go? I mean, yeah, we are removing a lot of HP overall because these guys are shielded. We have to destroy the pylons first. Although they're not shooting at us. Okay, um, here's the thing. We're gonna take the Thrall because that's a definite kill. We're gonna take out firepower first. And then we deal with the pylons, and then we deal with what's left of them. Uh, this is the progeny leader, by the way. Uh, they're in the back. I don't know what she's gonna do. I hope not much. Uh, two, four, six damage. Mm, he's at seven. We can only deal six total. with Even with the, the armor reduction. The, the Arkan is not a target that we can hit. I mean, we can hit him, but we cannot kill him this round. So yeah, we just move forward. Hi. Alright. And we're gonna hit something. It might be the Thrall. Might be one of these pylons, honestly. See, this is not enough. Yeah, I have the feeling that these pylons have to go. Okay. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Fire. Good. One down. And that definitely has reduced their additional hit points. Cool. Uh-oh. 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 What's happening? Oh no! Big AoE thing. We probably should get out of here. Yep. 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 So, first things first. Um... Damn it. I want to heal Patchwork. That's important. Let the high-tech spray do its work. Do I stay in this area? There's a burnout coming from this Arkan. Okay, okay, okay. Do I just move? Or do I try to shoot here? 
There is a chance we kill the Arkin. Let's try, okay? Let's do it. Destroy the shield. Good news is that Cherub has another active turn before the Arkan, so we can try to take she him knows. out if nothing bad happens. Five damage. Oh man, I'm out. It's fair. Kinetic shield on yourself, buddy. Shields up. Man, my positioning is so awkward here. I don't like it at all. But that'll destroy both the Arkin and the Thrall. Let's go. Gotta do it. Now. Made the arrest. Hell yeah! Two more people unconscious. That's cool. Alright, Violet. Hollow underneath, like What's the kinetic shield? Man, we gotta destroy the Codex and the Sorcerer quite quickly. Cool. And finally, we can put somebody into stasis. Uh, but what about our ceasefire grenade? These guys are all, like, mentalists. Yeah, they will do some other things anyway. So, can we put... Violet into stasis? I really hope so. Maybe it's the Codex that we're gonna put into stasis. Because it's the next... Yeah, it's the next target. Yeah, you know what? We're gonna do that. Like, it's next in line. It's next in initiative order. So, take him out. Or turn. And then I still think that we want to shoot or destroy one of these pylons. Let's go. Melting hardware. And down they go. Alright. Cover me while I reload. So Godmother is out of ammo. Hmm. Where is she? She's in this vortex, which I think gave her the problem here. Only we had a grenade or something. Um, we can try to subdue. Dealing a bit of damage. Getting into a position. But we can also just... And this is the thing that I want to do. Just move forward. Getting into a better position, even maybe getting the high ground here. And then reload. Yeah. We need to be able to deal damage. So, that's what we do. Reloaded. Boom. Good. Terminal. Terminal definitely has something to do, and that is safeguarding Cherub. Next big thing. Um, is he shooting something here? She's very, very far behind, so her hit chance will not be that good, but maybe she has line of sight to the pylon, which is easy to hit. I mean, it's 60% to deal little to no damage. He's moving forward. Headed worm needed. This is a tactical move here. Hostiles a tactical turn. Next round, we have the... Um, the ability to, to go cooperation again. Ouch. That's a dodge, very nice. No ammo. Yeah, you also auto ammo. But we don't need ammo where we are going. Godmother, be protected. Armored up. Alright, very nice. Oh, she also got aim. Yeah, you know what? That's pretty good actually. Uh, this is the only target we can actually see currently. Mm. I'm not too happy about that. Maybe we reload. We reload. Okay. Back I want in. his weapon charged up again so we can uh, shoot the pilot with him next round or something. Here comes Violet. You watch and wait. It's okay. It gives us another charge. Cool. I think at this point, we're gonna take it rather slow, deal with the pylon first, because it's the most efficient damage reduction, or like, um, health reduction that we can make. Oh, this is good. It is super duper mega risky, but I wanna deal damage. Can Let's go. Cover me? We have armor, we have full health, we're gonna zap them. Ah, they're immune to mental effects. Okay.
Okay. Zapping the target. All right, very good. Um, we dealt damage to the guy uh, or girl here in this uh, in this case with the lower health because I wanted to I wanted to take him out now. This is an easy choice here. Move here, having uh, cover against the codex, and then we do scatter shot in this direction. Missed! Oh no! All right. Here comes the teleport. Oh, nice flanking. Codex is also able to teleport, although it came out of whatever. Okay. Armor is holding though. Armor is holding. And it's time to be super aggressive now, I would say. Yeah, let's go cooperation with... With Patchwork. Hell yeah! Let's do that! Alright, that's gotta be cool. We're gonna Chain Lightning. Ha ha ha. We're gonna Chain Lightning the Sorcerer. So that he doesn't do anything to us anymore. Shocking that's okay. You got him. Zapping him, and now he's down to one, as well as one armor, but, but, oh man, there's a pretty bad hit chance that we can actually, hmm, ah. can we subdue him? No, we are, no, we are mildly out of range, so in order to make this work now, I could either, how are we doing, let's go, two thirds of a hit chance, and we even knocked him unconscious. All right, pretty good. Uh, our charges are two, so we probably deal like five damage. Yeah, it's five damage. It's pretty solid though. I will shield terminal, or do we shield Cherub? We shield Cherub, that's okay. Oh, and now I don't have enough movement anymore. Ah, I see, I see, I see, I see. Uh, that means we can actually shoot the pylon, maybe. Let's do that. Yeah, it's okay. But it's two health off of the codex. And again, it's a target that we have to shoot anyway at some point. Is Violet. Let's go. Tyranny on the codex. It's moving back. That's, that makes a lot of sense there. Psionic bomb? What's happening? Oh yeah, it's one of no these things ammo. again. And the weapons are disabled. I hate you guys. I hate you so much. Uh, you know what? You know what? I'm okay with that. We put uh, Violet into stasis for the moment. Alright, fine. And now we're gonna kill this guy. Zapping the target. I don't care about the psionic bomb here. We're just doing that. Ammo out. Oh, ammo out. Yeah, whatever. Whatever. Let's go, like, down here and do our best. Uh, actually, I should have subdued here. I should have subdued. Reloading. Might have at least tried. Cool. Should safeguard. And then we shoot. You didn't have to do that. <laughs> you didn't have to do that? Of course you had to. 60%, let's go. Hey, that's two damage. It's pretty good. Oh man, I'm out. Yeah, you're out. Uh, but what you can do is. Huh. What you can do is uh, you can you can you can you can you can kinetic shield patchwork. Now that's and then get out of the bomb radius, and then I think we got it. I mean, yeah. We definitely have this in the back now. Shifting position. It's all about how much damage do we take and, and how, like, in which order are we gonna kill these guys now. So this is the Codex, he's done, bomb is going off. Patchwork is taking the damage to the Kinetic Shield, no problem. Charged up. We gotta get a charge. Give me a moment to reload. Yeah, easy. Easy. Okay, Stasis Field ended. Here's what we do. We're gonna move next to her. That'll deal a bit of damage from the drone. 
And zap. And we're gonna drone her. Oh, you got a reaction to that. Interesting. Uh, yeah, I still want to drone her. Boom. Bring the hostile. But it's five damage. And she's down to what, three? Yeah, we can deal. Well, we can deal with that. No problem. And then now that... Oh, that's perfect. She's next to Godmother now. Oh, look at that. Dude. You came to the wrong neighborhood. <laughs> All right. This thing is nearly empty. We got her. Uh, fire? And we finish with a critical. Hell yeah. Let's get out of here. Excellent rating. We get eight captures, 20 intel on top of that. That was really good. And we got the first big leader here. All right. Let's see where this is going. <sighs> what a cool mission. So, it is also Friday. That means we're gonna get a good money. Great job, no, wait, we've got that squad. already. The progeny thought they could force a psionic evolution. But their tech was only capable of scrambling psionically sensitive minds for miles around. You stopped the progeny in their tracks and saved hundreds of lives. Yay! We did it! So, faction is defeated. After reviewing the intel from your investigation, we're left with more questions than answers. The progeny tried to build a psionic weapon atop an old skyscraper. This required secrecy. Mayor Nightingale's death made their goal more difficult to achieve. Worse, there are clear signs they had external backing. Until we know more, we've designated their silent partner, Atlas. Should we run down leads on Atlas? No, there's too little to go on. Mayor Nightingale's death remains your priority. You mentioned two other groups who could have aided her killers, but... Focus on one. If Atlas becomes more than just a theory, we'll update. Interesting. Alright guys, what are we doing next? Shall we go for Grey Phoenix, which are like the scavengers who are like... I think armored and they have crazy weapons and so on? I think we can take them. And then, as the last faction, we're gonna take the, the bioweapon guys. Hmm. I wanna take on the bioweapon guys right now. And then later on, we're gonna talk about Grey Phoenix. I think they are more predictable in the late game. Alright, let's take them. Sacred Coil is what happens when former Advent officers find religion. Or create one. They claim to be the true path for City 31's hybrids. As long as that path involves armed sedition. Okay. And, uh... Hi. Can I get out of this here? Hello? Ah, there we go. So, we have new supply items. We have the scavenger market open today. So let's take a look at that. Hair trigger. When firing, and the agent has a 10% chance that the shot will not cost an action. Holy crap. Okay. The first two reloads and emissions do not cost an action. Wow. Advanced auto loader is pretty good. Targeting system, short supply, hold a targeting to the target. Man, 10% chance. You can do it like another, like that it doesn't cost an action. So that's action economy is so important in games like these. 10% is 10% worth it. This is an automatic two reloads and emission do not cost an action. The advanced autoloader is pretty damn good. We can only afford one of them. We are too intel short of getting both the hair trigger and the autoloader. Oh man. Oh man. I like the hair trigger. A lot. I buy it. Alright. Cool. Anyway, guys, I would say that has been it for today. If you enjoyed this episode, then don't forget to leave a rating or subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And if you want to support me doing what I'm doing here, there's a link down below in the description leading to my Patreon page. And I hope to see you next time. Goodbye.